How's it going everyone? Welcome, welcome, welcome. How are you today? Today we're going to talk about two things. We're going to talk about the roadmap to Grand Blue Fantasy and what's going to happen in the near future. And also we're going to talk about the state of play of Final Fantasy 7 Remake that's going to be happening tomorrow. So but first, first off, let's talk about Grand Blue Fantasy. Uh, a little bit of my thoughts about the game. Great gameplay. Having a blast with the game. One gripe I do have with the game is it's hard to connect with other players online if you want to do missions and such. Like if you're trying to queue for a mission and trying to play with other players, it's kind of hard. Maybe because I'm not at the end, end game content. I'm like at the extreme content right now. I'm not at the chaotic level yet. Maybe a lot more people are doing that than me. So that's just a little gripe I have of the game and wish it was cross play. But let's go into the roadmap of what's going to happen to this game in March and April. So March, we are going to get a super boss, an end game boss, a multiplayer uh, boss named Lucius. This challenging quest will let solo players or groups in co-op multiplayer battle Lucius in a simulation of the final climax against a fallen angel. Being Lucius will require using all the skills you learn throughout the reeling gameplay. So prepare your best equipment and abilities before taking on this formidable foe when he arrives in, as a free update it's also cool that they are doing uh, a lot of free updates especially this is march and then they also have another april free update i, I assume this is free two new playable characters in april 2024 not sure if it's going to be early or mid or late april the boss right here lucius boss is going to be available early march so that's pretty cool coming soon less than a month away i believe sailfon dual wields swords and excels in close range combat melee combat unleashing a barrage of slashes and combos on foes that's pretty cool. Uh, longer swords. I know I'm going to butcher this name. Uh, Twin provides long range support with her bow and a variety of magical arrows with different effects. That's pretty. Uh, I think I'm going to play her. They do have two range characters, like the well, multiple range characters, two with the guns, and then they have a few magical characters in this game. That's pretty cool. Uh, I like the arrow builds, so I'm definitely going to try them both out when they drop. They will be dropping in april and then there is a may update but they don't say what's gonna happen in may it's like a question mark it's still a mystery right now so at least we have a clear roadmap for the next three months of what's gonna be popping for grand blue fantasy relink a game that i definitely recommend you guys trying it is a blast i've been having fun with it i don't know if i said it before but definitely more fun when you actually play with like real players or your buddies online i've had the most fun doing that than just do going into them or playing solo just like have no group members and just have that challenge of fighting bosses just like by yourself and not with any cpus but you could also do uh, cpus online and have a full party then but it's just not the same for me so with that said what is next is we're going to be talking about the state of play of final fantasy 7 rebirth that is coming out tomorrow at the at the time of this airing i'm airing this on monday and tomorrow will be the state of play for final fantasy 7 rebirth uh, i expect a a demo to be released or a release date when that happens or maybe we'll have a demo tomorrow who knows i think i'm gonna shy away or close my eyes and not look at this um state of play because i don't want anything spoiled I i've seen enough with the trailers and the teases tease trailers with all this happening and gameplay trailers i've seen enough i think and i just want to go into this blind the best i can so i will be not reviewing the state of play i will just play the demo if they do release that tomorrow or in next week or this week sometime or whenever they decide to release it i'm pretty pumped about it and to stay away from any spoilers teasers from now until the game releases i did re purchase the physical copy because I did, I did get some amazon gift cards for my birthday so i was like bump i'm gonna get the physical copy of this game and it has two discs i'll definitely display that when i get it and i'll show you guys how it looks because i know a lot more people buy it digitally these days instead of physical and i thought why not buy the physical of this one so that's the news for today let me know if you guys are excited about grand blues future and how are you guys liking it so far if you have played it let me know if you're excited for final fantasy 7 rebirth because i'm super pumped about that game and i'm excited it's coming out the end of this month very soon i'm definitely pumped and if they release a demo i'll definitely do a gameplay and post it on here love you guys stay risen stay rising and until next time 